Good morning, YouTube and Lock and Load Ninjas. I've been teasing something on the show for the last two days whenever I play the G Code ad. G Code has been a sponsor of mine for years. But I haven't been able to tell you what they told me and what they showed me, so, but I get to now. So give me one minute. G-Code has been a sponsor of the show virtually since the show began and Scott Evans and Jesse Lockhart and I have taken classes together. Um, my relationship with them is very intertwined with their product line. And G-Code is primarily known as, you know, a maker of holsters like this NCOG inside the waistband hard shell Kydex that is designed with some nice fuzzy covering so that you can wear it comfortably inside your waistband. But a lot of people want to carry their magazines. And G-Code has gone through this evolutionary process over the years since I've been associated with them. In the beginning, it was something like this. I don't even know what this is called. It was innovative at the time. It came with an RTI attachment. You could move this off your belt, stick it on your vest. All of that modularity that the G-Code brings with it. As you can, anything in the G-Code line. And uh, when these came out, these were revolutionary. But Gico, Jesse Lockhart, has like a brain that weighs, I think, 15 pounds. Although, you can't tell it because he wears a normal sized hat. Jesse is not happy with things the way they normally are. So, all of a sudden, here comes the Scorpion line. Now, this is, you know, it's Kydex. It's going to hold on to your magazine with a soft, fuzzy lining on the inside. It's two pieces held together with shock cord. And, you know, not only do they make them for the AR magazines, but they make them for your pistol magazines as well. And, once again, with the modularity, these are set up as paddles, but they can have RTI attachments, and they go. So, when I saw those, I was like, I don't know. I, I guess the innovation stops, because how do you beat that? How do you take Kydex and turn it into something that moves and beat that? That was like, you know, Terminator 2. How are you going to beat those effects? Well, today is the grand unveiling of their latest product line, which is called the Soft Shell Scorpion. Now, um, these are highly innovative. Um, I don't know enough about them to uh, be able to tell you about them right now, but I'm going to have either Robin Knapp or Jesse Lockhart come on the show, and we're going to talk about how these were developed. Um, I'm going to try to get some of these to stick on my traveler's bag because these are the, the way they're set up. If you'll notice, they've got channels right here so you can run Molly and you can stack them if you want to do it. Or you could stack this one on that one if you want to do it, take the paddle off and do that. They just keep on going. I've got some other stuff coming, but this, this is the thing I've been teasing this new product line, the soft shell scorpion. Check them out at tacticalholsters.com. Shows available at gcnlive.com. Ammoland.com. Streaming daily there. Lock and load radio.com. Also available on Stitcher, iTunes, and a whole bunch of other podcast ways. If you're in a, a radio market and you want the show, contact Genesis Communications Network and look for a young man named Adam Miller and he will hook you up. It's never been about gun control, ever. It has been and it's always going to be about total control. I'll see you out there. <laughs>